Hi, I'm Carl. And I'm Shane. And this is Angelica. Welcome to Pause for the News. Pause for the News. We're bringing you an exclusive story, breaking news, just happened not too long ago. On Highway 11 southbound, we had three loose horses running down the lanes from Gravenhurst, Ontario. Okay, we do oh. have reports of it. We've got someone on the way out. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay, are you going to call some form of an animal control as well? To, yes, to... we will. Okay. Yeah, we'll okay. try and uh, get as much help as we can. We'll get there as soon as we can. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. Okay, bye-bye. Stay in this lane and go slow because they're going to panic her. We can't get them to jump over. Sadly, what we discovered was that the impatient motorists weren't stopping to try to help these animals out, which an injury could have occurred. Come on, was the car beside you here? On this side? No. He's on, yeah. Well, get I'm blocking this top. I'm blocking them. I personally held the traffic back. Let's call the police again. Yeah, where the heck are these people? Why hasn't somebody picked that woman up that's back there? Hi, yes. How come no police have arrived yet with regards to these horses on southbound Highway 11? Uh, um, we're just at the um, uh, we're Pioneer Handcraft. Pioneer Handcraft. They're just. Okay. Uh, Are they going down the northbound or southbound? No, they're southbound. They're southbound. But they keep running in the middle of the road. And they're running again. Yeah, the yeah, they're running. We're 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 right behind them. They keep running. World down the window. Shaney's trying to talk to you. Oh. Drive off on the X-ray. Okay. Oh, that's a good idea. Okay. And then, once the police arrived, I was able to jump out of my vehicle. All I had in my hands was a dog leash. I wrapped it around one of the horses' necks, which then, in turn, stopped the other horses from proceeding because that specific horse had called out to them. Yeah, maybe just let me go then. Can I have the rope? Yeah, I think we're spooking them with too many people right now. <laughs> oh, that's good. Uh -oh. No, he's calling them back. Okay. They'll come back as long as... You, you, do, you do horses too, right? Yeah. You can tell by the boot. That's all that we needed to do. Okay. Thankfully, none of the horses were injured. We were able to walk them off the highway and onto an exit off of uh, Southwood and Highway 11. Just zooming by. Yeah, and... I was so worried for the horses. We followed them right from pretty much the uh, wildlife sanctuary. Oh, really? Yeah, called wow. 911. Yeah, he wants to catch up to his friend. No, you don't. Best to, to call right away. Plus, I uh, phone the radio station too, and at 95 to let people know what's yeah, happened. Hopefully, they're good thing nobody got hurt. Wherever right? they're from, no, horses are fine. <laughs> uh, the police think they're on. They were on Canning Canning Road. Some they named some farm. I don't know what. So they've gone there. The other <laughs> police have gone to look to see if it's, it is them. Oh, okay. But they're gonna keep the highway closed because they think there may be some more got out. A happy ending. Oh, there was a, a fellow behind us a couple of inches just riding our tail and then what happened was um, I we moved over just a, um, a little bit and he fired himself he shot right through and almost hit the honking horse his horn the honking time. his horn the whole time and yeah, almost impatient so but shouldn't there be a driver's complaint put on well, do you catch, did you catch his uh, drivers yeah I got it on video Oh, did you? Yeah. Oh, nice. The brakes loose and the other one's Oh. Well, he's the one I caught. Yeah. So he wasn't... He's not aggressive, but he's the one that breaks out. Oh. He's the little devil. It could have turned out to be an unfortunate situation, whoever it didn't. And thank goodness that the owners have come. They've just picked up their, their horses, and they're going to be walking them back to the farm. They have declined an interview from us. However, it has turned out to be a very fortunate situation. You're too shy, are you? Yeah, I yeah. am, so. <laughs> I, we do appreciate it. Yeah. yeah. 
Okay. Please visit our website, pauseforthenews.tv. There's a survey box. And let us know, do you feel that these impatient motorists could have done something more for the welfare of these animals? Thank you for joining.